My name is Jose Holguin Veras, and uh, uh, the William Hart Professor and Director of the Center for Infrastructure, Transportation and Environment at the Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute. My area of research is uh, humanitarian logistics, and as part of these duties, I basically was uh, a, was a invited to travel to Haiti to see what kind of lessons could be extracted from the disaster. One of the most important findings that we have produced is that uh, the, the following the disaster, two different structures of, of humanitarian logistics emerge what we call agency-centric efforts and what we call collaborative aid networks. One of the most surprising findings is that these collaborative aid networks are basically the social networks that we have in place already that have been created by churches by and other uh, social groups, have basically hold the key for efficient distribution of local aid. I mean, they have very extensive networks of individuals who know each other, who trust each other, are trusted by the population, that could basically uh, provide the knows that we need for effective uh, distribution of, of critical supplies. One of the important ideas that we need to keep in mind is a good humanitarian logistics is basically is like the circulatory system in the sense. You have a major arteries are basically transporting blood and you have at the same time you have thousands and thousands of capillary vessels that distribute, distribute tiny amount of blood to all cells in the body. In the same way that you cannot connect the aorta to the capillary vessels, because you need something in between, you simply cannot connect the aid coming from, from the national donors directly to the population in need. You need something in between. And this something in between is basically these collaborative aid networks. And what we are proposing is basically to, to somehow a, achieve a more effective integration between, between these large international donors and these local groups. The large international donors have the blood but lack the capillary vessels. And these this, uh, collaborative aid networks have the capillary vessels but lack the blood. And joining the two will basically result in a more effective humanitarian logistics and less suffering.